Hello and welcome to a brand new vlog on the Buzz and United Superfans YouTube channel. Today I'm heading off to my first ever Palmer's FC game. I've been supporting them for a while on YouTube um, since since 2015. They formed back in 2013. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm really excited for it. Um, they're, they're a team of you. Uh, they're a team of YouTubers. They they vlog all of their games. Uh, they have two about 200,000 subscribers on YouTube. If you haven't done so already, go and subscribe to them. They're an absolutely amazing football club. And uh, to, today, yeah, they're playing in Basildon today. So, but why not? I'll go and watch their game today. It's going to be absolutely amazing. I can't wait. Today, uh, Palms FC are facing a team called South Shell United. Um, yeah, I don't really know anything about South Shell United. I just know Palmers because I watch all of their YouTube videos. They're an absolutely amazing team. Really looking forward to it. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe, please like the video, and yeah, speak to you in a bit. Yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to run into Asda, grab myself a drink, because I don't think any of the shops near where they're playing are going to be open at this time in the morning. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly run into Asda, grab myself a drink, and then I'll be on my way to Palmer's FC. So I'm a bit worried that I've wasted my time right now, because I get the feeling Asda's not open. It's not open. Oh dear. Yeah, so Asda is an open. I'm apparently too early. It opens at 10 a.m. I don't have time to wait because, uh, I mean, I don't want to wait 40 minutes anyway. And plus, I'll be late for the game. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to check upstairs and see if there's anywhere open where I can just get like a, a drink. So I don't, I don't want to go somewhere like McDonald's to get a drink because I'm because I'm not going to be able to save that during the game. Okay, so Poundland, my only other option is shut as well. So <sighs> that's disappointing. Okay, thank God, Greg's is open, so I can get a drink from there. So Greg's was open. I've got Dr Pepper, my can of Diet Coke to last me 90 minutes. It should work. Okay, so I had no idea. I literally had no idea they were playing here. But, obviously I've come here to watch Palmer's, haven't I? Palmer's FC. But, I've just realised that Pitsy Athletic Sunday team are playing here. Not the first team, the ones I've been to watch before. But, um like their second Sunday team. That's going to be a bit awkward. So we'll arrive at the James Hornsby school. So uh, the Palmer's players are currently training. Um, I've got a Palmer's shirt given to me by Charlie, one of the players. Um, so thank you very much, Charlie. I really appreciate that. You're a great guy. That's clear to see. Oh, 
Yes, go on. Yes, go on. Yeah, oh. Oh, yes, well done. Oh, yes. Go on, Nozzy. FC3 uh, South Shell United nil. Uh, really entertaining first half. Brilliant. Um, yeah, hopefully more of the same in the second half. Lovely. Oh. Oh. How's he missed that? Just missed, uh, not, uh, just missed a goal. Uh, six nil Palmers now. What a game! Go on, Jazz, have a shot. Go on, have a shot, Jazz. Oh, I thought I was cutting in. Go on. Oh. Yes, get in there. Seven nil to Palmers. Let's get to the world. Get! Oh! Go on. Oh my word, how has he missed that? Oh. So. Oh! Man up. Uh, oh, coming in, Rick. Oh. Yeah. It's a break. 
Full-time score is Palmer's 9, uh, South Shell United 0. So here I'm with uh, Smith, a uh, gr ground hopping YouTuber, and uh, you run things around Palmer's, yeah? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, he's a guy behind all the editing as well. Um, how would you sum up that performance today? It was, um, it was a strange one, wasn't it? It's one of them games where, obviously, you come out 9-0, you think we've absolutely wiped the floor of them, but to be fair to them, they're, they're, they're a good team. They've got really good individual players, fantastic goalkeeper. We just spoke to him at the end there, and he's, he's not actually a goalkeeper, he's, he plays on the wing, so um, fair play to him. Um, could have been a lot more if it weren't for him, but um, yeah, we did what we needed to do. And I think it's quite easy for you, you turn up against teams like this. We've had, well, we've got the bottom three teams coming up. Yeah. We've already played one, played these today, and we've got another one coming up. And I think a lot of teams in and around where we are have sort of thought that they've already won it just by turning up and um, that's not the case and that's the reason we're in this good position at the moment we don't turn up to these games thinking that we've won it we keep our head on the game and to be fair the first I don't know what it was it took to, to get that first goal but it can be a nervy time can't it you know you think the longer they stay in it the longer it can um, can go on as a nervy one but no we um, we scored one then two and then I think their heads dropped after that yeah. by half time it was three I think yeah, it was. It's true. I can't remember. But, um, <laughs> no, I think their heads dropped after that, and uh, it was, uh, we, we played our football and relaxed in the second half. So it was good. Yeah, good. Um, and I, I think uh, didn't you say like you're close to winning the title of this league? Didn't I think you said? Yeah. So yeah. we're. Uh, I think as it stands, we're currently third, but we've got six games in hand. So if you look at it that way, we should go on and win this. But like you say, you still got to turn up to your games and win them. Yeah. And um, that's not what the other teams around us have been doing. A lot of teams. Um, they've been drawing against each other, so they've not been getting those maximum points where we've been turning up and we've been beating teams. So, yeah, no, I think um, we've got a few top sides to come, um, but we should. I think we've got one hand on the trophy, but I won't get too excited yet. Yeah. That'll be a treble if we can do that. That'd be lovely. Yeah, I know. Yeah. All right, uh, thank you very much for your time, Smith. No um, I'll leave a link in the description to uh, Smith's uh, channel, channel if you haven't subscribed to him already. Also, I'll leave a link in the description to Palmer's if you haven't subscribed to them already. Um, both appreciate all the support. Um, yeah, so go subscribe, like his videos, you know, keep up to date. And yeah, uh, thank you very much for your time, Smith. Really nice appreciate one, it. Thank you. Ta -da. I'm currently now just on my way home from uh, James Hornsby. Um, what a game it was. Finished 9-0 to Palmer's FC. I'm so happy I got to go to my first ever Palmer's FC game. I mean, I've, I've followed them so much on YouTube for a while, since about 2015, I'd say. Um, and yeah, here, got the match ball and I got a shirt from them. That's just amazing, so thank you so much. It was an amazing experience today. I want to thank everyone at Palmer's for being so welcoming to me. I want to thank Charlie for the shirt. Um, I want to thank Smith for the ball. Um, yeah, it was an absolutely amazing experience. So thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching this match day vlog. I don't know if I'll be going to any more games. Um, but yeah, of course, yesterday, Basel United played Whitsam Town FC in the last game of the Bostic League Division 1 North season. Um, that will be out today, the day of recording this video. Um, I'm not sure if I'll get this out on the same day. Um, I'll try to. But yeah, it's, it was amazing today. So uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Please like, please subscribe. And like I said, go check out Smith and Palmer's FC. Links in the description. Go check them out. They will really appreciate the support. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.